Hello, hello, hello. Today is Friday, January 31, 2025. Problem 222. It was suggested by Eugen, but it is a classic problem. And I may have covered this also in one of my 801 lectures, but I do not remember. But it is quite possible. It may also be covered in one of my 801 help sessions. In any case, here it comes. We call it a rotating beaker problem. A cylindrical beaker with radius capital R contains water. Initially, the beaker is stationary and the surface level of the water is flat. The surface of the water is a distance h below the rim of the beaker. The beaker is slowly rotated about its vertical axis to an angular velocity omega. Because of viscosity and friction with the beaker, the water will also rotate. After some time, all the water can be assumed to have the same angular omega. Question 1. What will be the shape of the surface of the water? And that's the classic part. <laughs> B. What is the maximum value of omega in terms of R and H? before water escapes over the rim of the beaker. That was added by, by Eugen, by the way, by Eugen. Assume that there is always some water in the center of the beaker. I do not consider this an easy problem. Could, would I have been able to do this when I was in high school? No. But maybe you, in high school, could have done it. You may have been at a better high school than I was. All right, so this was my first problem. When I reached the Stone Age, on January 29, 